All right, so I'm taking a trip out in the Hobie right now. And I just realized that this Nightcrawler container fits perfectly in there. I can take the cover off, not have to worry about it at all. I don't know if that's an intentional thing to this design, but I wouldn't be surprised with how many awesome features this thing has. Like, stay there, Junie. That's my dog, Junie, right there. With the reverse, some easy steering here. And I'm gonna go see if I can't catch a few panfish really quick. Put it forward there. But I really, really love the stability of this thing. Like I can do whatever I want in this and stay extremely stable and not have to worry about tipping over. I can stand up when I want and fish. I got a wind taking me a little bit here. And what's really nice, what I love a lot, is I can just take this rudder and steer. And you guys will see, I'll actually point perfectly with that wind where I won't need to paddle at all. Here right now I'm pointing perfectly horizontal with that wind. So I'm not really getting pushed much. I'm not drifting too far off my spot. I can get right back in there. And that's why it took a while for this one to get hooked. It's just a little perch. Sweet. Now, I'm right up here against this island. I don't wanna bust my rudder on these rocks here. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my rudder adjustment. Pull that rudder up. Still gives me a little bit of steering. Not quite as dramatic, but I can just get myself out of this cover, pull that up, and extend this rudder here. It's a little stuck on me right now. But look at that, extend it right back down. I don't have to worry at all about that thing dragging, getting destroyed. And a lot of these components, anything that has the potential to get snapped off or to hit a rock is flexible enough that you can just pull it up or you can, uh, you can actually go ahead and hit the rock 90% of the time, it's not gonna ha cause any damage to it, especially these front rudders, these front paddles right here. Gemento.com